Right, lads, welcome to the year 395, and the Roman Empire is split into two, the Western and Eastern halves. Um, you've seen me play this mod before, the Fallen Eagle mod. Uh, I'm going to be doing something a little bit different today, and instead of trying to break it apart, I'm going to try and reunite it. Uh, there's a lot of issues with the rest of the Roman Empire. I mean, in about, what, 80 years' time, Rome is about to be sacked, and the fall of Rome signals the end of the Western Roman Empire in, like, 476. So today, against all odds, we are going to see if we can hold it together. Uh, I'm also going to try and reestablish the Roman Empire, but I'm pretty sure that's going to be a bit tricky. Now, this is an incredible mod with uh, things like chariot games, uh, trade, uh, and also specific imperial laws. Uh, if this thing collapses, which it might well do, uh, yeah, my entire realm is likely to collapse. So that's not good. First things first, we're one over our domain limit, so let's go and give away Cremona. Abandoning Britain might be an idea. Such cool art. So that would essentially make us leave. It would free up considerable troops and administrators for the rest of the empire and grant to you a large amount of gold. I'm tempted. I am tempted. We can make people like us by giving them bread, but it's incredibly costly. I'm pretty sure things are going to collapse. Um, we could fight the uh, Eastern Roman Empire. I do have claims on them. But I really don't think that's a good idea. I think trying to inherit them and ally them, good idea. So let's do that. We're going to ally them. Instability in the empire. Our empire's vast and frontiers always threaten the resources that we need to maintain it to grow thinner and thinner by the day. Many regions are left defenseless and resources open to barbarian raids and other invasions. So we need to act quickly and decisively. So I was not, I'm, I'm good at acting quickly, just not decisively. Strong and sweeping reforms are needed to ensure the longevity of our realm. So... We need to keep those high. How do we do that? So the size doesn't help us. Integrated territories don't help us. I don't have to change all this. All right, we're gonna grab ourselves this law thing here. Uh, and we also need to get ourselves someone to educate us. Preferably someone in ways of stewardship. This man. Now we have money and that's about it. Uh, we're gonna increase our crown authority. I hope so that will help this. We have about five years before everything collapses. I need a better, I need a better guy here doing domestic stuff. We're being raided, that's not good. And our court grandeur level is decreasing. Uh, okay, well, let's get rid of the raiders. Let's start with that, we can, we can secure that at least. Oh God, there's the Senate. Okay, they want me to convert the region of Nicaea. My dread goes down, but the popular opinion goes up. Military powers, I don't need more military. Taxing rights, oh God. Oh, so my taxes go down, but Senate parties would distribute bread all over the empire if possible and always sponsor games. That sounds good. Devolved government? I mean, let's let's give it a go. All right, let's change the province of Nic Nicaea. Nicaea? I don't know how to pronounce that. No longer being raided when they're left. Ah, I'm straight. Zealous, fickle, lazy, arbitrary ball. My rival is dead, the, the African king. Roman Empire does not look good. My courtier, he hates me, but he's also terrified of me. So that should help. Isn't he raising me? This man... Oh, it's not him. Okay, good. They just look very similar. Okay, I need to increase my court grandeur level, but like... I can't afford it. <laughs> I have no money. Oh, we'll chuck some things in the walls. We've got a damaged obelisk. That's pretty cool. And the bust of Marcus Aurelius. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie. I, I think I messed up uh, by reducing power. What's this? Lower county control. Just just one. That's fine. Okay, we've got some commentators. Um... I'm going to do something real stupid here. I'm going to destroy all of my men at arms. And I'm going to use that money to increase my court grandeur. It would cost me 27 months. Okay. I can't afford it. Court grandeur is going to have to go down, boys. People are going to become independent. No. No, 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 no. We keep together. Okay. We have a peasant uprising, but it's a small localized one. And I've raised all of my troops over there. That was not smart of me. Oh, no. Your civic confidence has collapsed. That's... Not good to see. Definitely should not have lowered the taxes. Uh, we also make no money now. All right. We're a man. And we're somehow worse at administrating before. We have zero in stewardship. Sweet Jesus. Okay, we're dead. Um, we're going to marry this girl. And then just get her to manage the empire for us. Manage domain. That's still not enough. Okay, we're going to have to give away two more provinces. Oh. Guess we have to go down the Marshall Tree. Let's see. No one is voting for me. <laughs> to become the... Emperor of East Rome. That's mm, that kind of sucks. Okay, we're about to lose our diplomatic competence as well. Oh boy, <laughs> more dynasty legacy. Yay! I'm just really trying to consolidate what I have. What happened to my brother? Oh no, he's dead. 
Oh, you know what? I'm not I'm not here to, to die slowly, boys. My brother is dead. We can't have someone else on the throne. We're going for the Eastern Roman Empire. <laughs> it's gone so badly. Okay, they landed behind us. We'll take a couple of territories here. And <laughs> let's march down here. Dangerous faction. Oh, sweet Jesus. No, 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 no. We're fine. We're fine. I've just had an idea. He surely isn't getting into... Uh, Autonomous vassals. Okay, we'll do that. Okay, that's fine. Autonomous vassals is good. They made me... Yeah, they made me drop my crown authority. That's fine. I like that. That's... Yeah, that's why I did it. You know? That's... That's... I... I decided to do that. Because then, you know... It's like uh, having vassals in E4 that you just want to get rid of. That's good. Nice little victory there. Split in two. And we'll gather ourselves some supply. Okay, they're coming back. Okay, they're coming back. They're coming back now. Come on, survive. 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 Win. I mean, we did. <laughs> I don't know what's going on. Crescent supplies back. And I reckon we wait for them to come again. We have the money to sustain this, and we have not... Mm, want a dependent. I might just give it to them. Screw it. We're abandoning Britain. We'll come back for it later. All right, we're imprisoning someone. I don't know what they did, but I'm doing it. Oh, pull out, pull out, pull out, pull out. All right, if we can beat him before he wins that siege, that's ideal. I've gained a right hand. I assume I had one already. 52. Just can't afford to lose any battles, basically. Take the reins, buddy. Oh, not a time for me to fall ill. Okay, spread out a little bit. Get some more supply, because I'm not about to waste my entire army on this. Catch something, please. Don't march in there. I'm moving somewhere. I think they're going to try and siege us back, so we've got to get there first, so we can kill them. Right, it's important to get some supply back here. Right, they're doing something. What's this? Sure, I don't know what that means, but sure. Okay, I'm just going to try and catch a couple of thousand of them. So, uh, that's a thing. But game's, like, lagging out a lot when I zoom out. I need to zoom in. There you go. Okay, so we, we have it. Uh, we can reclaim Constantinople. Did I just, I think I just clicked something like Head of Faith title. Okay, now I need to re-establish the Roman Empire. Everyone hates me because my court grandeur is below expected level. I I don't have the money. What do you expect me to do? Okay, let's hold court, I suppose. Popular human minus 20. Okay, I'm just going to pay money to get rid of that. I've got a hippo out of control. Oh, right. Region of hippo. <laughs> I thought I just had an actual hippo out of control. Okay. Sure, we'll stop killing people, I guess. Okay, that cost me a lot of money. I swear you. God, you hate me so much. Just general hatred. Okay. It goes up each year. Um... Okay, violet vassals have high. I think giving them more rights is probably a pretty good idea. Getting my popular opinion up is kind of crucial. We're going to do that. I think it might be an idea for us to switch over to domestic affairs. All right, we do need to up our prestige because we need to get to illustrious and then we can do the whole room and empire thing. But things are kind of tenuous right now. Oh boy. You're Hellenic? Why are you Hellenic? All right, how do I get these people to not hate me? Okay, some of them just already do. They want independence. Jesus Christ, this is not going to go well. Here we go. Okay. Hey, Duke Gunderic. Where are you? Okay, cool. Um, let's focus on our vassals first. It's the Independence War, and it's the King of Salia, the main guy. Where is that? Just show me where it is. Where is Salia? Okay, you're up here. Sweet. Okay, so you're isolated. And those are your troops. Let's hope we get some lucky victories here, boys. <laughs> this is such a scuffed playthrough. I don't even know what's going on. Okay, this guy has like 9,000 troops. I can give them the land. What lands did you want? Yeah, dude, turn up, bro. Or not. I don't have the money. I don't have the money to spend on this. I'm currently in a war, bro. Catch him, please. How are you so fast? How are you so fast? Finally, we caught him. Let's go get his capital. Wait, what? The Western Roman Empire is destroyed. I'm now just the Eastern Roman Empire. What happened there? Where did Hispania go? How'd you do that one? Okay, we'll get it back in a bit. Just, just give us a second. Okay, so because... Because the Western Roman Empire collapsed, it's now treating me like I'm the Eastern Roman Empire, which means I'm getting the other events. Okay, that's fine. We'll preserve and honor it whilst I'm fighting over here in the uh, in the actual Western Roman Empire. All right, we need to go east. Sorry, what? It collapsed. Eastern Roman Empire is this. I am the empire of number of nowhere. This is bad. Okay, where do I rule? Okay, so my empire's collapsed, right? It's done. Who am I fighting? An independence war. Okay, so let's let's do that. Okay, we're gonna have to do what I feared from the start and just rebuild. Why can't I siege down this province? I can walk through it, but I can't siege it. I have to like click down here. Okay, all right, murder these troops. We are now illustrious, so technically we could have done the Roman Empire back in. All right, and we've defeated this lot. So let's take stock of our lands. We now own Italia and Tenare. We have 1,400 troops, a decent amount of income at least, but our throne room is... Uh, not, as, not what it once was. Right, we're gonna focus on my son. 
because he's quick and we're gonna educate him. <laughs> God damn, everyone else is stronger than us. It says I have four provinces, I don't know where the fourth one is. Ah, I have Constantinople, which is our capital. Right, we're going to become autocratic because this whole Senate thing didn't work. Our jester is our, oh God, <laughs> chancellor. Right, we're gonna wear the regalia of the Western Roman Empire. We're gonna wear our helmet, don our sword, and we're gonna try and reclaim as much of the empire as we can because it's collapsed in our lifetime. We collapsed it basically, basically uh, and we're gonna get it back. Right, we're gonna take back the Diocese of Thrace first things first, mainly because he only has like 200 troops. Why would I wipe these? Someone else joined, who's that? Okay, Orientis, excellent. All right, we're gonna need some men at arms. Let's raise them. Fickle, content, uh, get fickle, why not? And we're gonna need some onages. God, it feels really weird to be starting from nothing. We used to have everything, boys. All right, it's been a few years. Uh, I've managed to silently carve out a little bit of uh, a basis for us uh, taking off provinces from Dacia, Macedon, and uh, obviously the guy that we were fighting uh, initially. Uh, yeah, it's been kind of miserable, not gonna lie. Uh, it, it's kind of sucked, uh, but that's fine. I've just been basically doing what I'm gonna show you now, which is declaring the wars, raising up our troops, and marching down into these provinces, because this is a very tumultuous time period right now. We do have decent troops though, which is which is kind of useful. It's helped by our commanders being decent also. Oh, Algerian culture is a thing. It's interesting. Let's get some more supply and march in on you. Ah, and my son has come of age and he's a charismatic negotiator, which is perfect, it's what we need. Um, I wanted someone with decent uh, diplomacy because we're gonna be, because we're gonna need to be buying claims and such. Uh, that's sort of the only way that you can go around grabbing a uh, decent chunk of them. Okay, I inherited this. Uh, also, conquering these territories means that I can give it to individuals, right? So, oh, also I conquered uh, some land down here, which is quite useful because this guy's quite powerful. I just sort of nipped in, grabbed some stuff. Uh, these guys are all loyal because I gave it to them directly versus the other guys who are obviously uh, still kind of pissed about the whole collapse of the Roman Empire thing. Right, that will finish that one up. Uh, do I have truces? No, I don't. It's just constant. <laughs> do I give stuff to my player and son? Probably not a good idea. Let me check what the succession is like. I'm pretty sure it's just primogeniture. Yes, we just get to everything. 21 year old genius. Let's chuck you in. And let's continue a conquering because I want to restore the Eastern Roman Empire. Can't we just capture him? Ugh. We're getting kind of lucky with these wars, I'll be honest. Just capture them immediately. Ah, uh, let's throw her out. There we go. Lovely. <laughs> One person has smallpox, throw them out, no people have smallpox. Tell you what, for someone who uh, literally oversaw the collapse of the Roman Empire, this guy's doing okay for himself. And we've come out of it with primogeniture succession, so I can't really, you know, complain too much. It's a lot nicer now. Our issue is the guy that holds Rome is super powerful, so I don't know if I'm going to be able to get past him at any point in the near future. Absolute control. Like I said, I just enjoy the fact that this guy is, grew up as a probably a pampered kid, right, in my sort of headcanon. Um, he grew up as a pampered kid, dominated the Roman Empire, and then suddenly had to learn how to do all of this sort of stuff. Like, actually, you know, survive and, and struggle, I guess. There you go. Uh, you know what? We'll give it to our son. All right, boys, onwards, always onwards. We're also going to get some palace guards. I've been waiting for those for a while. They're kind of really, really good. <laughs> Come on, catch them, please. Please catch them. There's one army dealt with. Let's grab the second. Which one's got the honors? This one. There we go, murder him over here. Ooh, that was actually kind of painful. Oh God, did not notice him fight me there. <laughs> and my eyes drift for a second. All right, dangerous faction. Yeah, yeah, let's get out of this war. It's costing me too much. Uh, oh God, there we go, 100%. Enforce demands, there we go. Uh, we'll hand this off to our other son. Just assume that he'll be loyal. Could very well not be. My wife hates me, that's fine. All right, dynasty legacy. Let's get ourselves some dread. All right, let's also improve Constantinople. What a Build the Hagia Sophia, why not? Uh, limited crown authority. I don't know what I clicked there. <laughs> Might actually be easier to form the Empire of Carpathia. <laughs> not sure what the, the tributary stuff is about. Screw it, well, um, let's see what happens if I do the whole permanent tributary thing. I wanna see what that's like. It says they'll like become annexed after 15 years or something, or 20 years. I know there are guys on my eastern coast, no, that's okay. One thing we don't like is money. Ah, oh, nice. We've discovered husbandry. We can farm, boy. Need to be a bit more careful, apparently. Well, I, it, the insistence on not going through Constantinople is shocking to me. I don't know why he just hates it. All right, there we go. A little quick amphibious landing. Oh my God, it takes so long to catch anyone. There we go. And another one. There we go. What the hell is this? Ah, oh, that's not going to show up anybody. All right, there we go. Permanent tributary. 
What does that do? Arrow flying index. Okay. <laughs> Wait, what? This dude's my tributary. Just a wonder. So, they pay 10% of their income to me. That's fine. I can't declare war on him. 20 consecutive years of being tributary, I can annex him. Again, no idea what that means. I'm just going to keep doing what I do best. Expanding my little corner of the Roman Empire. He doesn't know what to do. Well, that's, a, that's another couple of thousand troops that I wasn't expecting. I'll probably go and murder them. All right, boys. He's dead. He's dead. Now we have this guy. Oh, no. Immediate war. All right, give me a second to sort this out. All right, so the man who lost the Roman Empire is dead, and I'm his son. All right, we're two over our domain limit. That's fine. We should... Oh, you're already managing domain. Someone wants the kingdom of Thrace. I'm already fighting, apparently. Okay, well, we beat that guy. Uh, I want to give away these lands over here. They kind of... Uh, kind of suck. Oh, we're leasing it out. I'll give Pavir away to this dude. All right, where are we fighting? The main dude is over here. He's the Duke of Thrace. Ah, it's my brother. He's like, he actually likes me. That's nice. Two direct vassal limits over. Um, start creating duchies, I suppose. The money for it. All right, we're going to reset our perks because I want to buy claims. Which one's that again? I know there's one of these that allows me to buy claims. That's buy artifact claim interaction. I don't, I don't like that. It's sanctioned loot holes, isn't it? <laughs> I should have gone learning. We'll go down the diplomat tree anyway. All right, let's start putting things on, I suppose. Who is educating my son? What is he now? He's a skilled tactician. But to be fair, he's intelligent and stuff, so I mean, I can't really be mad. Get ourselves the best set of amenities. It's costly, but it's probably worth it. Right, we're actually looking pretty good here. Um, I've just sort of been silently focusing on it. Uh, the commentary's not been that great. Uh, we are over our uh, vassal limit, so I want to get rid of this one. Uh, so we're going to grant this to our son, if possible. We do have 100 dread. Right, let's continue going down the coast, I suppose. Got a ridiculous amount of money. Take out this army. It's actually proven a little bit tougher. A little bit strange. I suppose this is my like terrible army. This one's my main one that I've just sort of sent into the fray. Oh well, I was meant to do it the other way around, but this will do. Oh, we've already gotten the win. <laughs> I'm not wearing earphones, so I can't tell. Okay, right. Continuing the theme of handing off everyone to everything to everyone else and securing our money. We have three thousand. Be building things in Constantinople. Oh, you see that split apart? Can I? You wouldn't join my realm. Why not? Base reluctance. What if I sent you money? Yes. This is why I wanted this guy to be a good diplomat because I have a lot of money. So I can just sort of uh, send people cash, then offer the vassalage, and they'll accept. I could just request people to become my tribute. Nice. Okay. okay I'm just going to go around and ask everyone to be my tributary. You won't. Uh, we have a different heritage, different faith. But what if? Money. Yeah. <laughs> right. Let me, let me just keep this going then. Uh, under 21, yeah, you won't do it. Tell me in 20 years' time, I'll just annex these guys. But you don't like me. What if I sent you money? Request tribute. Yeah, that's working. Sweet. I can also do it over here. And this Roman lot have been a thorn on my side for ages. And apparently you. People are so up for this. Minus 50, huh? What if I sent you money? This man's going to unite the Roman Empire by just being a good lad. Dude, everyone's becoming tributary. Look how many I, I sent. Send me 300? Sure. All right, so 20 years, so 72. See how long that takes. I need to fix all this. I need to fix the regalia. I need to fix this headgear. I want to fix this Roman Sparta. My issue is that you're allied to one of my tributaries. I need it to stay continuous for 20 years. So, okay, we've got a wonder on our hands, boys. And you've got 10,000 troops. That's fine. I make 34 ducats a month. Well, it's not ducats, but you know what I mean. Let's grab some more of you, get rid of this regiment, and create another regiment of comet whatever you are. I mean, you're all expensive, but you should be worth it, right? All right, 9,000 versus 10,000. Bang. That's why we pay in the big bucks. You have, no, uh, you have no idea how many times I've been paying off these raiders. It's nice to finally be able to fight them. Not raiders, they just come in to settle because they want to migrate. Oh, where are you going next, huh? Back there? Okay. And then he just comes back. Oh, hang on. Oh, I've taken his war banner. And 100%. Excellent. We found a holy order. Let's do that. We just got to basically maintain our hold of everything for the next 20 years. So I have 18 tributaries. Oh, nice. Natural dread. Let's put that on all. Court grand is pretty high. Or a warlike court. Ah, my son's dead. Is that one of the good ones? Nah, we still got this boy. How is your prestigious low? Ooh, Theodosian brooch. Chuck that on. What a stable realm this guy's created. Look at that. Everyone loves me. Oh, I don't have a single negative uh, vassal. Excellent. It's honestly a disgusting amount of money I've got right now. I've still got our, like, uh, starting holdings that my, what, my great-grandfather? No, a grandfather had. My wife's dead. I wonder what the religions are. Become obese. Why'd I do that? Uh, let's just distribute bread everywhere. 
We can also sponsor gladiatorial uh, games. Let's do that. Oh, actually, let's build the Roman art bathhouse. Why not? Let's do that instead. Large amount. Let's import some amber. Don't know what that does. We're going to do it. All right. Uh, he's dead. Okay, let's figure this out. So we have a lot of money, no prestige. Uh, we need to give away this duchy. Grant two, my player and son. That sounds good. This guy's a martial one. He looks exactly like his father. Ah, oh, Dynasty Legacy. Uh, let's go for glory. Actually, no, uh, Vibrant Court. All right, it does look like we're going to have to be fighting some people off. That's okay. It's pretty standard at this point. Fortunately, this guy's very, very well suited to that. It's called the Foolish, but he does have a 29 Marshal. And my son is a lustful, zealous, just Grey Eminence. Dude, that kid is good. All right, come on then. Let's square up. How's my court grandeur decreasing? Some money handing out, it's fine. Put up some furniture. We've got Roman cabinet right there. That's nice. Everything's at max. All right. There we go. I will not be threatened. That's a Liberty War. Right, where are they? He's over here. Let's go take him out. God, there's so many people. All right, you go seed him down. You go murder him. Another 3,000 troops are going to go murder over here. I just want to take a second to appreciate the artwork that's here. Um, I saw the designer um, of this, of the, uh, of, of the character models in the comments. And uh, I just want to say, you are fantastic. Everyone who watched this is fantastic. It's incredible. <laughs> okay, that was just about a victory, that. Okay, there's about 4,000 going to land on my capital here. So now I to wait until 476, where I should be able to bring everyone back into the fold. Uh, so I'm also just in the meantime getting uh, banners and that sort of stuff. Uh, a brooch. I spent a lot of money on these. They're kind of not great. I'm just going to fight those men at arms. And they got. <laughs> yeah, we make a lot of money per month. Oh, another brooch. We have so many of these things. The current one gives me attraction and prestige. This one gives me fertility and prestige. Fertility and prestige. We've got a crown, but I kind of like this. Got a lot of stuff, boys. Because so I keep do trying to... I am trying to, like, upgrade all my buildings and everything, but it's just... It's we've got a lot of money and not much to do with it. Okay, so it's 477, and uh, for whatever reason, I can't actually annex my, uh, my tributaries. Uh, it's not because they're at war, because, for example, this guy. So I'm going to quickly... Nip it to debug and, uh, and annex them. So we're going to go ahead and uh, vassalize these guys. Because I should be able to annex them. I don't know if it's me being stupid or the, the mod's not working. So we're going to take title and vassals of these guys. All right, now that's done. Uh, this is what we are looking like. Which means that we can go ahead and reunite the Eastern Roman Empire. We're going to create the title of the Eastern Roman Empire. We're now back to where we were right at the start of the game. We'll restore the Praetorian Guard. And this guy would accept the tributary. Um, both of them would. So, I mean, I personally view that as a victory. Because, I mean, request tributary, permanent tributary. And then this lot over here. Can actually create the Empire of Gaul. <laughs> Notice how the second we uh, bring back the bureaucratic system. Uh, oh my god, we have 57 new. What does that? 47 new court artifacts. Oh boy. Skull of the Lion. Hide of the Cursed Rabbit. A better throne. <laughs> My knees are gone. The Spear of Destiny? The Veil of... What the hell are these? I could sort of play it through and uh, and annex these guys a bit by bit. but uh, Because to be honest, I'm way more powerful than they are. Uh, and, and blitz them. But I'm going to be honest with you. I have a burrito waiting for me. So I'm just going to, again, divide the debug. All right, now that's done. I want to draw your attention to the fact that Reged has both got provinces up here and in North Africa. And we can click reestablish the Roman Empire. It cannot uh, survive this empire is split in two. Yeah, about that. Oh my god. Uh, we've turned into Hispania? Hello? I'm gonna make uh, the Roman Empire my primary title, I think. There we go! Um, I'll take that. Obviously, at the end, uh, a little bit of debug, but I think that still counts, considering I would have had to have just conquered not Britain, but just sort of the Empire of Hispania, which I could have uh, picked that. But I had them both as uh, tributaries, so I count that anyway. I'm not gonna lie, when that first collapsed, I did not think I'd be able to do this. It's been uh, many hours. Many... <laughs> Many hours, hence my desire to sort of speed things up at the end because, by God, I actually haven't eaten today. Uh, and it's it's 4 p.m. and I woke up at 9 a.m. So, uh, yeah, very hungry. <laughs> so we've got the Senate back. Um, <laughs> and that's what crushed in the first place. We're losing money, so inevitably we're going to die again. But we did what we set out to do. And uh, hopefully you did enjoy. So if you do enjoy it, then please do like and subscribe. It really does help me out. And I will see you all next time. Bye. Huge shout out to our patrons, most notably Charlie Demorel, Krilly, Flyerton, JDow52, Cargon, Xiaomi, Lewis Wright, Nicole's Christ, QA Shard, Redguard, and Shadow Singer. Your support means a lot, guys. Whilst you're here, you might as well click on another video. I mean, it's it's literally right there.